It wasn't my fault. <sighs> I really didn't have anything to do with it. There were men in suits. And they watched. It surely wasn't a pleasant experience for anyone there. I don't know why. Does anybody ever know why? The outcome was horrific. I found an arm in the backyard the next day. It seemed strange because I had never found an arm in the backyard the next day. So I was a little confused. Mm. Why? Why is there an arm in the backyard? And whose is it? Oh, there's some things you just never get over. Uh, I don't know who... I don't know who did this or... what my part in it was. I don't remember much. I was... I was all drugged up. I had been doing some... Heroin. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it was me. Maybe I put the arm in the backyard. But I don't think so. I think I'm a pretty good guy. Yeah. And they found the they found the other parts strung all over the city. Uh, one of them was in a mailbox. There was a leg sticking out of a mailbox. Oh, man. Oh. Let's hope the kids didn't see this. And then apparently all, all the limbs had been severed and put in different places. And then the torso. They froze the torso. And then they covered it with chocolate ice cream and put it at the park. I mean, I don't, it's pretty sick, isn't it? Yeah, little kids running around. They see a big pile of chocolate ice cream and, and then, of course, these fuckers, I mean, they bought some plastic spoons and they put them right next to the chocolate covered corpse. And of course, you know what kids do. Oh, ice cream. Oh, look, spoon. Let's eat some of that. Oh boy. Then they got down to the corpse. Well, it wasn't a corpse. It was just, uh, it was a torso. Because the leg was sticking out of the mailbox. And, and the arms were, and the other leg, all scattered around about. <sighs> Who does this kind of stuff? Oh, I want to know. Oh, and it smelled. Once, once you get all the chocolate ice cream scraped off, it smelled, and the horrific odor emanating across the park, and people were running in all directions. Oh, that smells bad. I'm running. Yeah, it was terrible. Uh, but some of the kids, they weren't very smart. They just kept digging in. Suddenly, they're eating the corpse. Uh, you can't blame them. They're kids. I wouldn't. Oh, fuck. 
Somebody did this, though. There's, there's some bad people out there. And dismembering people and putting arms and legs in mailboxes and scattering them around. The, and then they put the corpse and cover it with chocolate ice cream. I mean, strawberry? Okay. I like strawberry. But I wouldn't have dug all the way down. You know, these kids, I think they're going to be damaged. Will they know? I mean, the parents don't have to tell them. Yeah, oh, it was good. You, you ate some chocolate ice cream and then you, you started eating a dead torso. I don't, if I were their parents, I wouldn't tell them that. I'm a caring person. I just wouldn't do, yeah. Well, you probably had enough to eat. Let's go home now. Oh, fuck. This is this is the situation we're in now. We get people who put torsos in parks and cover them with chocolate ice cream. This ain't the this ain't the world I grew up in. Yeah, we used to put the torsos out in the desert and bury them. Yeah, we had we were sensible. Yeah. Don't, don't fuck up the minds of the children. No, you know, you, you can be as sick as you want to be, but why fuck up the children's minds? Yeah. I wonder, I wonder if anybody ever dug up all those corpses out there. Oh. We'll never know. Legs and mailboxes.